So we begin this half hour with a community mourning. Utah Air National Guard announcing today one of their airmen has died unexpectedly while serving in Guam. ABC4's Northern Utah correspondent Cade Garner joins us with more in Roy. Cade? The Roy community has a special relationship with the Air Force and with those who serve in the military as a result of being so close to Hill Air Force Base. And when they lose one of their own who's serving in the military, they go out of their way to make sure the family is taken care of. This is Tech Sergeant Burton Patrick Jungle, his wife Kaylee, and their beautiful daughter. They are really fun. They both are a military family, both for the Air Force, so they are very into the military. They both are in the National Guard, so they are away as much as they have to be. Um, but they are both really kind, you know, really quiet and to themselves type of people. The jungles are transplants to Roy, but have made family here, like their friend, Addie Williams. It is heartbreaking. I wouldn't know what to do as a mother. And she's pregnant, has a baby on the way. The Utah Air National Guard says Tech Sergeant Jungle had an unexpected medical emergency on November 25th while stationed in Guam and died in the hospital four days later. It was so unexpected. No one had any idea and could have planned or prevented this at this moment. Jungle's unit commander says, quote, this is a tremendous tragedy for all of us deployed on this mission. Tech Sergeant Jungle was an outstanding airman and performed his job with enthusiasm and a positivity that motivated those around him. While this is a shock, Williams says Kaylee, who is also serving in Guam, is doing well. She just has a lot. We just need to remind herself to take care of herself just as much because she does have an unborn child. But she is doing good. The baby's healthy. She's healthy, doing good as much as she can. Williams says it's hard to help a friend who is currently so far away, but has started a GoFundMe as well as an Amazon wish list to help Kaylee and her babies. The Utah Air National Guard will release information for the graveside services once those services have been scheduled. Reporting in Roy, Cade Garner, ABC4 News.